First at five tonight, a way home. This week, the federal government announced new mortgage rules aimed at helping young people buy their first property. CTV Stephanie Sikos looked into whether the changes are enough to make real estate more affordable for homeowner hopefuls. Stephanie. Maria, while these new rules are welcome news, there are now concerns they could actually cause house prices to soar again. Getting into the housing market has been a challenge the last few years. Buyers are frustrated because in a lot of cases they're not happy with what they can get for their pre-approval. And as rates have gone up, those pre-approvals have gone down and down. It could soon be easier for younger Canadians. With these measures, first-time home buyers are going to be in a stronger position. New mortgage rules are coming into effect. The federal government is expanding its 30-year amortization to include first-time home buyers buying any type of home, as well as anybody purchasing a newly built home. Now with the amortizations being extended to 30 years, it will allow the same borrower to afford a more expensive home or it will enable some people that were just priced out of the market to be able to get into their first home. While it will allow first time home buyers um, easier access to the market in the short term, it might have some negative implications long term to the cost of housing and in fact the debt that those uh, first time home buyers have to pay back. The price cap for insured mortgages will also be boosted for the first time since 2012, moving to $1.5 million from $1 million to allow more people to qualify for a mortgage with less than a 20% down payment. Now that might not have as much of an impact here in Halifax and around Atlantic Canada, but it will impact those first time home buyers in Ontario and BC. While this is a step in the right direction, this real estate agent says more needs to be done. Allowing people to spend more money and take on more debt um, is a double-edged sword to say the least. We need to actually see prices of homes for first-time home buyers go down. Now, these changes won't actually come into effect until December 15th, which may leave some prospective home buyers on the fence about whether to buy now or wait until the new year. Maria. Uh, thank you. It's an educated bet, isn't it? Uh, thank you, Stephanie. CTV Stephanie Sikos for us in Halifax tonight.